Hey girl, welcome to my channel. My name is Jasmine. If this is your first time here at my channel, welcome. So today I wanted to try out some drugstore products on my face. Some of these are new, some of these are older products that I love. And yeah, I just wanted to share my drugstore everyday makeup look 2021 edition. <laughs> so if you want to see, then keep on watching. Also, if you're not yet subscribed to my channel, click subscribe down below, join our family. And without further ado, let's get into the video. So I'm starting with some lip balm. This one is from Flower Beauty and it's called the Color Shift. So I'm just gonna put some of this on. My lips are so ashy and dry. I like the way this looks and feels. It has a little bit of color. So we're gonna go into primer. I'm gonna use one of my favorite primers from the drugstore. This is not new to me. Well, it's like not super old. It came out this year, I think, or last. It came out in 2020. Last year. So we get to say that last year. Anyway, so I'm gonna just rub some of this into my skin. This is my first makeup tutorial of 2021. For foundation, I wanted to use my e.l.f. CC cream. It's not really a foundation, it's a CC cream, but it's amazing, I really, really love it. So we're gonna use that today. And I have the shade 540N for neutral. So should I do my hand? Yeah, I'm gonna do my, hmm. I'm just gonna pump some on my face. Oh. Where did that fall? <laughs> right here on my finger. Thank goodness, not on my shirt. I'm gonna use my little sponge from Amazon and puff it in. I actually really like this product a lot. It's really good. Do you guys wanna see a full face of Fenty? I thought about doing a full face of Fenty because I love the new powder so much. I figured I could do like a full face, you know, using the powder and everything else that I have. Let me know if you guys want to see that. So how are you guys doing? How is the new year treating you? Let me know what any of your um, new year goals are. You don't have to be too specific or too detailed if you don't want to be, but any goal that you're willing to share, let me know. For concealer, I'm gonna use my favorite drugstore. One of my favorite drugstore concealers is this one from L'Oreal. This is the Infallible Concealer. It's really, really good. I feel like you guys have heard me talk about this before. Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna take my, take my beauty blender and just blend this in. So I have a ton of new goals or things that I want to do for this year. Some of them are personal and then other ones not really so personal. <laughs> um, one of the things I definitely want to do is be more active on Instagram. I feel like Instagram is like so hard for me to keep up with for some reason and I definitely want to be more um active my present with you guys on instagram so go follow me um jasmine erdell i have it linked and i also have it on the screen so you guys can check it out i definitely want to be more active and do more things on there and post more all of that you guys i'm born in 1991 in case you didn't know 91 so the, do you know how old i'm turning so i'm literally gonna be 30 this year what it's crazy I, I I can't believe it I'm gonna do my, my brows right now and it's literally around the corner because I am born in February I'm gonna take my sponge and just press that in again to make it more nice and sharp I really wish I could go somewhere on vacation you know somewhere nice and far or just like warm but I'm so scared like I you know <laughs> we're still in the pandemic the pandora whatever you want to call it so you know we can't really do anything too crazy or go anywhere too far or you know so that's annoying but it's okay it's okay we will survive i'm gonna just contour a little bit today i'm feeling kind of contoury what was that I'm gonna use a little brush and just brush this upward so I know some of you guys I know I know people are traveling like I see people on Instagram 
um, traveling. I don't know anyone in my personal life who is traveling. Even some of my friends who always travel, who always, you know, go places, they're not going anywhere. They're not really traveling, but I do see people on Instagram um, on vacation. I feel like it's just too many chances of getting exposed from the airport to the plane to the the plane is like the worst part I feel like because you're like in the little plane and they they don't have social distancing in planes they actually they did at first I think but now it's like they fill every seat I think they pretty much fill up every seat and there's no like social distancing in the plane I think that's the part that's like more concerning to me so I just add a little bit of concealer right here to tidy up a little bit. Okay, so I'm going to use this powder. This is the L'Oreal Infallible Powder. I don't remember if I like this powder, but I saw it and I was like, oh, this is drugstore. Let me use it. It's a translucent powder. Let me just... I'm gonna put that in my crease. And I'm using this blending brush from ColourPop, it's number E2. And it's just like a fluffy blending brush. I'm gonna use this color right here. It says crease, but I'm gonna use this on my eyelid mostly. I did spray it a bit because I felt like it would be less fallout going on if I sprayed it. I have this eyeshadow palette that was sent to me by Flower Beauty and I kinda wanna try um, one of the colors in here. This is also sold at Walmart by the way. I'm gonna put that like in here I'm gonna take this dark color right here. I'm gonna put a little bit of that here. All right, so we're using the Flower Beauty Mascara and it's really good. It's the Warrior Princess Mascara. I'm also gonna put some on my lower lashes. I'm gonna use these lashes from Kiss today. They look really good and I've been really enjoying drugstore lashes. Loki, they've been really good lately. I'm gonna dust off my nose. I did my lashes. So I want to do a highlight. I'm going to use my Milani highlighter. This one right here, one of my favorites. It's really, really good. It's strobe light number four. I'm really just going to put this on my nose today. And then up here. Oh, actually, I'm going to put some in the inner corner right here also. All right, so I used my MAC lip liner because that's what I had in front of me. Um, but for my lips, I really want to try this new NYX product. This is the Shine um, Shine Loud NYX Liquid Lipstick in Gloss. It's like a two-in-one product. So I have this shade. It's like a nude. All right, so the lipstick gets a little tacky and you can leave it like this or you can make it glossy by adding the gloss over it. Since I haven't done a matte lip in a while, I'm gonna leave it matte today. I think it looks pretty either way, but since I haven't done a matte lip in a while, I'm gonna keep it matte today. I think it looks nice. This is my little drugstore makeup look and I love all these products that I use today. So this is my little everyday drugstore makeup look. If there's anything new from the drugstore you think I should be trying out, let me know in the comment section down below. And I love you guys, see you guys in my next video. Bye.